full color night vision binoculars see in total darkness. Ooh, good looking ones. Okay, so rechargeable, that is nice. Um, tripod mount goes onto here. Okay, on and off uh, pictures. So where's uh, there's instructional on the inside of it and it's on. Wow, that is easy to look to it. Okay, there is the view. We're going to plug it in into the camera and the camera will focus with that. It's just an amazing quality, wow. And it zoom out all the way. Now we zoom in all the way in and once it's done zooming in, all I have to do is just let go. It will focus automatically. Right now it's doing a good job focusing. So, really can see what's inside the barn, animals, deer, turkeys, perfect for bird watching. I don't see much birds, it's kind of cloudy out, but yeah, very cool. And zoom out, it's detecting, focused, zoom out some more, and it will detect in. Then I can do like black and white, so I guess it's a little bit easier to see movement. Let's see if it focus. They go focusing pretty fast. That is cool. In case it's too much color. And then I can switch it back. Okay, and this is what it's going to look like onto my face. There you go. Wow. So easy to navigate, set up on a tripod. Don't shake too much, perfect. Okay, we're outside in a complete darkness under the stars. See what it looks like. Looking good. Okay, now let's zoom in. Zoom is pretty fast. Let's say next to the trail trailer. Also, it will auto focus pretty quickly, or I can press to make it focus. This nice. And there's a barn fence but if you look over here it's even better there's a playground so cool so I can see very clearly if there's animals right up there so easy to find it too I love it let's go in the basement and go in the complete darkness that's pretty much complete darkness I can only see humidifier dots here and there Wow, that looks so good. Okay, kind of focusing. Let's see if I can make it focus even more. That is awesome. There you go. Climbers, uh, there's a pull and a rope grabber and this adjustable goes on the foot. So it's kind of like a steps up and down and uh, like uh, using a step climbing the letters but it's kind of a, like a rope ladder steps in a sense if it makes sense so to put in the rope slide it open put the open slide it like in okay and it's very simply goes up no problem slides out but whenever I want to hold on to it or even let go and use my foot to stand on it it's also adjustable so I could stand on the foot and hold it that. And the second one will go right next to it. Locks in, same thing. Goes up easily, but down will not go, and it will go on my second foot. So it goes on the shoe and slides in really easily and tight. And that's like a ladder steps, and then like a climber. Okay, go ahead, up. And obviously the rope will be quite tight. Da. Okay, next foot up. So with the handles, left, right, left, right. So two feet holding and two handles on a rope. That's awesome. Got it here, Gecko Notch Climbers. And so there's a logo. Nice soft pods over here. And there's a hooks with the leather and this side here, like a belt, um, also leather. Let's open it up. 
Oh, this is. You Velcro off. Oh, you gotta take it off all the yeah. way. Okay. So this comes off with the Velcro. Ooh, nice, sharp edge. Beautiful. Let's put them on. See what they look like. Nice plastic Velcro. Ooh, that's a stone Velcro. Okay, let's put them on. So we're just gonna show it. Okay, let's see how it goes on. Sideways like that. Okay, nice protection on a tree. Uh, okay, little swivel head here. Very cool. So a belt. Yeah, that belt looking good. Tighten it up. It goes under here, out of the way. And the Velcro oh, goes to here. Ooh, nice. Okay, and it's walkable with them too. Nice. Pets descender. So, we will need a carabiner. It goes into here. And that will attach to my harness. So, to fit the rope, opens all the way this way. The lever go all the way down this way to open the rope feeder goes to here, nice. And this is the safety in case they let go of a rope, it will go on and stop it. Nice, extra safety. Now, I'm going to lock this one and it will go to the carabiner and lock it. That's it. This side here will be attached to harness and this side here is an error and indicator of descent and then there's a lock indicator on lock this attached to the harness uh, the rope will be fed to here and this is like uh, to release it more and up so that way i can feed it slowly and in case i let go of the rope and it drop uh, this will bite into it and it stops that's it Pro Climb uh, 8KM uh, carabiners. What is 8KM? Each 1KM is 225 pounds. So 225 pounds multiplied by 8KN, it's uh, 1800 pounds capacity it should hold. So this is aluminum, they are lightweight. Really lightweight, but still we can hold 1800 pounds. Uh, quick uh, release, there's a pull forward, there's a notch, pulls forward, slide over, and then it opens. Okay, let's see. To put another one in, if something hits it, it will not open it. So the only way to open it, pull it, and then slide it. Okay, pull it, slide it, take it off. Okay, let's see if I can just pull it, and I can just slide it in this way. That is quite nice, so pull it open. So if I want to quickly attach two carabiners, so if I want to quickly attach two carabiners, just push it too. Awesome. Very lightweight, beautiful color to it. The uh, colors don't scrape off easily at all. So very nice quality. I like it.